Welcome aboard. This is the Dragon Cruiser, your rocket to the wildest frontiers of tech and space. Today we're soaring into China's three-body computing constellation, a daring mission to build the world's first supercomputer in orbit. From cosmic science to global strategy, this project is rewriting the stars. But who's funding this galactic dream, and can it survive China's economic storms and the U.S. tariff war? Strap in and let's blast off to find out. On May 14, 2025, a Long March 2D rocket thundered from Jiuquan, launching 12 satellites, the first of the three-body constellation. Imagine 2,800 satellites, each a mini supercomputer with 8 billion parameter AI models, delivering 1,000 peta operations per second, a quadrillion calculations every second. Led by Zhejiang Lab and partners like ADA Space, this project, possibly inspired by Liu Chixin's The Three Body Problem, processes data in orbit from climate monitoring to studying gamma ray bursts with an X ray polarimeter. It's a leap for science, industry, and maybe even defense. Think it's like Starlink? Think again. SpaceX's Starlink, with 6,000 satellites aiming for 42,000, delivers global internet. Three Body is a space based supercomputer, crunching data, not just relaying it. Its satellites boast 30 terabytes of storage and laser links screaming at 100 gigs per second, outclassing Starlink's simpler tech. Starlink's massive scale is about connectivity. Three Bodies' leaner 2800 satellite vision is pure computing power, built for a new era of space innovation. Now the stakes get higher. This constellation could reshape warfare. Picture real-time intelligence, spotting enemy ships or missiles in seconds for the People's Liberation Army. AI could guide hypersonic strikes with deadly precision or track U.S. satellites for counter space ops, like jamming or anti-satellite weapons. It's a strategic power play, challenging U.S. space dominance and fueling a heated space race, especially amid the U.S.-China tariff war. But who's bankrolling this cosmic ambition and can it hold up? The three-body constellation's estimated cost is $14 to $24 billion, including $2.8, $5.6 billion for 2,800 satellites, $5.85 a $7 billion for 234 launches, and $300, $500 million for ground stations. The 2025 phase, 50 satellites, could cost $275, $450 million. Funding comes from state-backed giants like the China Aerospace Science and Technology Corporation, CAS, with $294 billion in capital, and private players like Alibaba, linked to Zhejiang Lab, and startups like ADA Space. China's commercial space market, projected at $390 billion by 2025, adds muscle, with 82% private enterprises driving innovation. Yet funding faces headwinds. China's economy is under strain, 5.4% GDP growth in Q1 2025, but manufacturing contracted in April due to U.S. tariffs hitting 135% and China's retaliatory at 25% levies. A property crisis, local government debt, and declining U.S. export share from 19.8% in 2018 to 12.8% in 2023 threaten stability. The tariff war escalating since Trump's Liberation Day. Tariffs in April 2025 risks decoupling the world's top economies, hitting China's export-driven sectors like electronics. Will state funding hold? CASC's deep pockets and Beijing's strategic priorities, space dominance and military civil fusion, suggest resilience. Private investment, however, may waver if commercial returns falter, especially with unproven demand for in-orbit computing. The challenges don't stop there. Scaling petaflop computing requires radiation-hardened chips to withstand cosmic rays and flawless laser links for data flow. Space debris risks collisions in crowded low-Earth orbit, and regulatory hurdles over orbital slots could delay launches. Geopolitically, U.S. sanctions or rival constellations could disrupt supply chains, especially for chips reliant on foreign fabricators like TSMC. Despite these, China's supercomputing legacy, exascale systems since 2021, and state-driven resolve make this feasible, though the tariff war adds pressure. Dragon Cruisers, the three-body constellation, is a bold bet on humanity's future. It could unravel cosmic mysteries, power smart cities, and push AI to the stars. 
Yes, the $14.24 billion cost is steep, and China's economic woes and U.S. tariffs loom large. Funding from Cask and private giants like Alibaba is solid for now, but private investors may hesitate if tariffs bite harder. Still, every challenge is a spark for innovation. This is our chance to build a brain in the sky, to dream beyond borders, and to cruise toward a universe where anything's possible. China's leading, but this is humanity's quest. So, what's your take? Can three bodies soar through economic storms and tariff wars? Drop your thoughts below, smash that like button, and subscribe to the Dragon Cruiser for more epic dives into tech, space, and beyond. Let's keep chasing the cosmos together. Until next time, keep cruising the stars.